Hey guys, it's Hall of Fame time again. Hey guys, so we've been rearranging the furniture in the hall, we've been hanging the pictures in pride of place, and this is of course our new website, or as we like to call it, a digital home. So we did get some comments recently which boiled down to us being spread too thin across social media. This is in relation to the group exclusives and all that kind of stuff. Um, so the new site hopefully is going to address this and it's going to consolidate everything that is RS in one handy space. What a good idea that is. So the whole point of the group exclusive is to get people to look at the group and think yeah this is for me it grows the group and it grows our community and that's why we do group exclusives but maybe I think we're taking the point on board that maybe it was maybe too exclusive so the new site hopefully is going to try and address that but let's not forget the group exclusive is to promote the group just as much as it is to produce the exclusive prop. Also on the new site we have a new mailing list if you were on our old mailing list that is now gone because the laws change and we don't understand things. So we just thought, let's start with a nice, brand new, shiny mailing list. The mailing list is not going to be a spam thing, because we hate that. Um, it's just going to be an update, usually around once a month, but then we may add additional ones in if we've got something new and exclusive to tell you about. So don't worry about getting spammed. Nobody likes being spammed unless it's coupled with an egg on a muffin or toast. We hate spam, but we love news. So this is forming our new philosophy. And the most interesting part about that is it was only this morning that I discovered I even had a philosophy. So before we move on to the Hall of Fame, the new site, one last thing that I wanna mention. We've been doing this for, well, let's just say quite a while now. And some of the stuff that we've done has been lost in the, the abyss that is social media. So one of the, the best new features on this site is we're going to be posting up some of the stuff that we've done in the past along with news. You're going to find it in a section called Studio News because we've got no other title for it. But we're going to be posting up old stuff there, so please do check that out. I think it goes a little ways to explaining how we got to this point. And there's going to be a load of stuff in there that I'm sure, certainly if you're new to RS, that you won't know that we've done. And... I think it would be nice to share it and it gives you a better understanding of what we're all about. So when you're checking out one of the posts, there will be a sub-menu there where you can go to directly to interviews or portfolio pieces or whatever you want really. So just, if you've got the time, get familiar with it. I'm sure you're going to enjoy it. I hope you do anyway, otherwise I'm wasting my time making all these posts. The real aim of our digital home is to explain that it's so much more than shopping. On the new site, you will find we've pretty much got everything in the store with the exception of Boba Fett. Now that's gonna change. We're gonna shift things around and we're gonna bring new things in and then make other things unavailable just to allow us the time to do it. We don't wanna fall into that trap of having pre-orders and having a lot of one thing on. So we're gonna change it up. It's not gonna be like the old site where we just had everything available at all times and you could just go on and get it. The team can't really cope with that. We're understanding that now. So we're gonna change things around and there'll be times in the future where a tire pilot won't be available, but we will replace that with something else. And by changing it around, I think we're gonna make things a lot slicker, a lot faster and for us, and for you I guess, a lot less stressful. Probably the best way to stay in touch with what's new and what's going out the store and what's coming in the store is to sign up to that newsletter and we'll include informations about that as we go. If you go on the website, you will find the sign up for the newsletter right in the bottom, I think they call it a footer. You'll find it in there, just drop your details in and you're good to go, you're up to date with everything that we do. And like I say, you're not gonna get spammed. So back to the Hall of Fame. We're still dusting down and reframing some of the very early entries into the Hall of Fame. We'll be adding those as they are 
cleaned up and restored and fit for use. The hall is very important to us. These are the images sent in by you. This is your photography. This is how the suits are used and loved when they leave us. And that's just fantastic. That's what we want to see. That's, in a nutshell, that's what it's all about. It's not about us making this stuff. It's about how these suits are worn, used, loved, and demonstrated in these photographs. So let's take a look at the images that have been sent in for consideration this time around. So this time I absolutely love this image. This image captures, I think it embodies Star Wars. Now this image could have been good, what makes it special is that wind just catching the duster. That's perfection, that's, that's the, the element that we're looking at, we see that and it's like, yeah. I hope you agree. I also really like this image, nice, simple. We've not had to have the weather conditions. We're in the woods. It looks awesome. Again, it's, it could, we could be looking at a Star Wars movie. I absolutely love this image. I also love this image. I think what this one's really showing is we don't need a location. We don't need the weather conditions. We just need a good composition and making it black and white just adds that extra layer of cool. So which one of them is going in the Hall of Fame? All three are going in the Hall of Fame. That's right, this month we're going to put three new entries in because the quality of the photographs are there and let's get it populated. These images need to be shown, they need to be in that Hall of Fame. So all of you guys are inducted into the RS Hall of Fame. Congratulations. So as you can see, we are really proud of the Hall of Fame. The library that we're building has got some absolutely amazing images in it. It was only really we started to appreciate this as we've been updating our new website. I think the images speak for themselves. Just check them out. Look at them if you want inspiration and what's stopping you sending yours in. We know you don't need the exotic background, although it helps. It's also really cool I mean, we couldn't take these images because there's so many different locations all over the world. So to see them coming in and to see what you guys are doing, that is important to us. And I hope everybody is inspired and appreciates them. T-shirts, need to catch up on that. Now we're really putting some effort and some emphasis on the Hall of Fame. I'll be catching up with the T-shirts. So I know there's quite a few of you guys who are still waiting for one. Um, we've got a new design, so it was worth the wait and I'll be catching up and checking that out and making sure everybody who needs one has got one. Okay, before I finish off today, just got a couple of other things that I want to talk about. We've done some competitions and giveaways in the past few months that we never really followed up on. So let's take the opportunity to do that. Here is a cracking image that Don Wise sent us in with the Halloween helmet that we gave away um, around Halloween time, surprisingly enough. Looking awesome, Don. Great image. And I hope you enjoy the helmet. Another helmet giveaway. And we asked people to comment on what they would do with the helmet if they won it. And we just picked out our favourite comment. And Ian said that he would um, bin his SDS helmet. Anyway, he sent us this video. I think you're going to like it. <laughs>
there we go guys that's a hall of fame the library is building it's looking really impressive and i know it's only going to get better so do keep them coming in and we'll be adding more inductees next time but until then do check out the website please do sign up to that newsletter it's more important than subscribing to be quite honest with you that's where all the news is going to be and i will look forward to sending you those emails but not spam until next time that's been the hall of fame Don't need to do a different ending or what?